Am I the only one who tongue be on fire after they eat them some pineapple, but it's so good that it's low-key worth the pain? Today on day three of Back to the Basics, I'm going to show you how to efficiently, quickly cut a pineapple without eating up most of your flesh and throwing it away. So you want to cut off a thin layer of the head as well as a thin layer of the tail so you can work on a flat surface on both sides. You then want to start working your way around a pineapple, keeping your knife on an angle, making sure it's sharp, peeling off the skin. Use the shape of the fruit to your advantage. Don't go against the fruit. Now you see here how it only has a little bit of flesh, but mainly all skin. You want to repeat this process all the way around and don't worry about the brown sauce because after you get all the skin off, you're going to go around and then trim off any excess areas. This is how you get the most out of your fruit instead of trying to get it all off in one knife movement. Now that it looks good, you just want to quarter this in fours and then I'll show you how to remove the core. You stand up your quarter and then you just thinly slice the part where it's hard at. So you stand it up and you slice it out. After that, your fruit is really good to go to ready to be diced up. And the Bible tip of the day to get closer with God is to, when you are weary, when your spirit is low, worship. Put in your favorite song and just sit in the presence of God. Shout out to Passive Vlad for this tip, but your praise is a weapon and when you are doing this, I promise you your mood will change.